My name is John Ellinger. Uh, I've been with the company about 12 years now. I uh, work in product development for the Heavy Bid team. The thing about working here that, that I found different than other places I've worked, really a lot of it's just my coworkers. We have a lot of people here that are successful that don't have any programming background and they've been a successful programmer for years. I came from a retail background uh, where I worked in a grocery store and worked my way up into management. I was working at a um, uh, call center. I was going to be an actuary and I actually passed three exams. I have a bachelor's in psychology. I never had any kind of professional uh, programming experience before I came here. Retail. Uh, selling office supplies. And retail means you're going to work weekends, holidays, uh, you never get time off, you can't ever be sick, and, the, and it kind of sucks. So I thought, well, I need to do something else. I was always interested in computers. I just saw the advertisement from HCSS online and decided to come in and take the test. I'd never heard of another company offering something like that to, uh, to someone without a degree. But uh, I went for it and it's worked out for me. I've been doing a development here for about two and a half years. The key for a successful programmer is the aptitude, the attitude, and the ability to solve problems. Now, the first three months here was pretty much a training period. And the thing that I liked about that was we started out as a group of three programmers. So right from the beginning, we were put in a group environment where we're discussing how to approach a given programming problem. You know, you start off with the very basics of the language that we use, and you work your way up to designing a program that sort of exhibits your abilities that you've learned so far. The training program was pretty good. We have, uh, each of us has a mentor. Uh, all of that training actually uh, prepares us to be ready for uh, development, for real development. It was a formative experience and I enjoyed myself a lot. As soon as you walk in, you just kind of feel that the environment is, uh, is very friendly and everybody is very welcoming. Every once in a while we'll get together and we'll have like a team lunch where we'll play like apples to apples or you know some other game where we have a lot of fun and it's much more comfortable because it makes you feel like it's more of a hobby than an actual job um, sometimes we'll go for walks on the jogging track and discuss things uh, there's usually a game of horse each day and uh, once or twice a week we'll play some 21 and HCSS is by far uh, much more fun than it is to be in a large corporation and a lot of places, you know, my understanding is basically they come down, they say, here's what we want you to program, it's already designed, this is the way you want you to do it, and all you do is fill in the blanks. And that's not really the way it works here. You know, I actually worked at a large corporation before where you're a, a number, not an employee, and nobody knows your name. Um, and that's just a completely different environment than what it is here at ACSS. I've worked with Mike, our owner, I've worked with presidents and CEOs of companies for custom programming. I uh, really enjoy uh, the software and uh, my part of uh, programming is uh, dealing uh, with customers. It's really nice to go out on site with customers and see how they're using our products and seeing that it's actually making a difference. How many people get that opportunity as a programmer to, to go to the owner and say, no, your idea is not as good, my idea is better? If you're someone who requires very little supervision and actually enjoys stuff like programming, then this is definitely something for you.